Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to our Road to Glory series. Um, there is going to be a little bit of change to this series, um, which I will explain at the end. But yeah, we're going to get straight into this. And we did have a pack. It's a lone player pack. And this came from our um, the, uh, the journey. This pack came from. So we get a lone player. We've got a good hoon online. Obviously, we're not actually going to use him yet because, well, it doesn't fit into our team, quite frankly. That's a... Uh, Basically, why so he'd just be there for like reserve sort of player, maybe we get an injury or you know that sort of thing, and we have to have some maybe put someone in there as a replacement for like an um, off like match or two. Um, and then I did have a look at the squad builder challenges, see if maybe we could do any, but they just kind of cost too much to do, and yeah, I just didn't think that um they were kind of worth it, even though some of them looked really really nice, like that Abamian card for example, sweating 97 pace, and that's why I had a little look at it, I thought. Mm, what can we do here? And um, yeah, as soon as I saw the mineral rate of 87, I thought, I'm out of there. So I didn't really fancy any of the other cards, to be fair. The house at one looked quite nice. But um, yeah, that's how I cut about it. And as you can see, um, for when this goes up, obviously this is uh, quite a bit back in the past, this video. And um, yeah, that's why I'm going to explain a bit more um, later on in the video at the end. That Pirola card didn't seem out of reach to do, but only needed an 84 rated team I thought mm -hmm. I did think maybe that was possible but yeah no I didn't fancy it so back to the division games we go and obviously still uh, going with the CBA team and um, yeah straight into the first team this guy's got a bit of a bit of a hybrid team it's got like a he's got menace up there which is a bit weird um, I'm not quite sure why he didn't maybe go for like a Premier League strike or something like that to link with Payet but he went for the French link and then also got Schweinsteig in there bit of a Bundesliga Premier League French League kind of hybrid and before we know it we can't defend at the back and he runs straight through and we won the down in like four minutes I believe it was but it didn't take us long to get back we managed to shrug him off and get a shot away the keeper saved it but as often as it does in this game you get a rebound and we did that and we scored it obviously running the fitness kit as well so we go 1-1 and I have no idea what he just did here for the penalty no idea he slid in I think he thought probably we were going to shoot um, I thought maybe there's a chance to get a red card, but I guess we're facing away from goal. Um, he only got a yellow. Um, so we got a penalty. Pretty uh, very happy with that. Getting a soft penalty. Go to the right hand side. Keeper goes the right way. He dies the right way, but it's right in the corner. It didn't dive early enough to save it right in the corner. And we put that one away with Jovetic. And we go 2 and up and quickly turn the game around. And then, I mean, not too much longer either. <laughs> I don't know where it's defensive, just a simple triangle through ball and we slot that one home as well. Cross the keeper into the corner. That's a fantastic finish by, I believe, I don't know, remember, is that El Shahari there? <laughs> it might be, it might be. Yeah, just a, so easy that through ball, so easy. I don't know where his left back was, nowhere to be seen, too far up the pitch. And as you can see, actually, yeah, we are rocking the same kits, which um, I didn't mean to do, but we managed to, um, it got, it got a bit, it was a bit complicated at first, but we managed to dodge ourselves around it and he did rage quit. And therefore, as you can see, oh, it was Calihon, not El Shahari. I don't know why I thought it was El Shahari. So, yep. First game, 3 1 win. Very happy with that. Very comfortable. Quite easy to do. And uh, yeah, the stats kind of uh, show our dominance in the first 21 minutes there. Having all the possession, all the ball there for 65%. So we've got a 5 1 and 0 at the moment in this division. Just one more point needed for the next game to uh, get promotion, to get the title. And this guy's got OP Butland in goal. Um, it's also got Giroud and Slimani up front, which made me think to believe that with his pacey wings or blast and Sane, he just tries to get it down their wings, cross it in and try and get ahead on that with either Giroud or Slimani, being them types of players they are. But it doesn't do that. And with three at the back, I thought maybe we could exploit that, depending on how defensively he goes and does. Lovely skill move. Got past the first defender. And as you can see, we had a very nice finish there to put us 1-0 up. Into the 40th minute, we just kept running with Jahari, kept running. Beautiful skill move inside. I knew what I was doing. If it came off, I knew it was going to work. It did. We passed it inside one more. Sort of a sweaty goal, but I don't care. It doesn't matter how it goes in. We tap that one in with Edda. But that wasn't a game over. 45th minute. I don't know what went on here. Like, as you can see, the red mark went over my goalkeeper and I started um, controlling him. Like, I, obviously, I went to like, sort of kick it and slide. It was going back to him. I don't know why it switched my keeper, but like me controlling my own keeper, so he didn't run out. I didn't know, so I was running back into my own net because I still thought I controlled the defender. But never mind because it doesn't matter. Because in the second half, we got ourselves a third goal and we restored that two goal advantage, and that's how it finished. We did win three one, 
I was high getting another couple of goals. As you can see, I do change formation when I go into the games with a 4 1 2 1 2 bracket 2 with the two centre mids, the cam, the CDM, the two strikers, of course. We had seven shots on target out of eight, which is um not bad, not bad at all. And obviously, that win made us win the title. Oh, excuse me, the title. 5,000 coins for that we won, which is very nice. That will help a lot in our quest for uh, to get, obviously, new players. So into the next division we go, which I actually can't quite remember what it is. Is it? I believe is it like six we're now in. I think it's it division six or it could be division five. Don't know. But it's got Kings Cohen on the right hand side, even though he's a left winger. Like he hasn't even changed the left forward, so it's really not on much chemistry at all. But I still fancy myself in this division. We play it cheeky, a couple of little passes in there. Found the free man in the box, and that is Jovetic, and it goes one nil up. <laughs> Easy as you like. But about what about ten minutes after we've scored, it gets a ball through. We don't close him down. He gets too much space and time with Komen to bang one and scores it. And that was actually it for the game. After thirty minutes, nothing really else happened. Obviously, no more goals. We finished one one for our first game in our new division, which obviously I can't I like I can't remember at the moment. So probably because I'm doing this too so far, like after we um after actually recorded this, I think it's five, but we're no at the end. So this guy's got a semi-light rated team. He's got um sort of a hybrid team in there as well. He's got Fabio Contral, which I've never never seen him. He's actually got Lloris as well in goal somehow. Cavani up front, which every time I play against him, he seems to um, always cause me problems just because his strength and his shooting ability, quite frankly. But best way to stop him from scoring, keep away from him, and we do. We get loads of time on the ball. He doesn't close us down. We get a nice ball in. We get a man over. We pass it to him. And as you can see, the end result is a goal. Right on the stroke of half time, 45th minute aids, and we go one up. He actually started sending his keeper out a little bit there. I did think about trying to go for a goal, go for a shot. 10 minutes to go, and we bang one in. It's, I'm not really sure what his keeper did there. I think he, like his keeper should have saved it, but as far as I'm aware, it went pretty close to him. And he didn't really dive at it, it just sort of sort of sat down on the ground, and he had enough after that with only 10 minutes to go. So we get our first win in our new division, 2 0. Also, have to wait for this bit just to do its stuff. So very happy with that 2-0 victory at Anfield. Not many people seem to actually have Anfield. I believe that was Anfield. If I'm mistaken, I apologise, but I'm pretty sure that was. Um, yeah, so we get a goal for Callahan. A couple of assists. Our left back even actually gotten in the act and got an assist for ourselves. So yeah, 2-0. Sorry, excuse me. Um, yeah. LFC for life. Yeah, so obviously it is Anfield, isn't it? Based by its name. I don't know why he didn't just stay on in the game. I mean, he may have lost it, but I mean, even I would stay in and just go for the coins. I mean, like four or five hundred coins you get anyway for completing it, but it doesn't matter. This guy actually had a really nice team. He's got Renato Sanchez in there, which I really don't like playing against because he always seems to be in the right spot at the right time, which is a bit frustrating. But it's got Dybala, Quadrado, that Pereira, I believe it was, scored bit of cards. And um, yeah, I do not know what I was doing. I have no idea what I was doing there. Just Douglas Costa runs past three more players. Goes straight in and scores. And I believe the same thing happens again here. Yeah, he just keeps running. Just keeps running. Pass through my players. And, you know, that is just some aids right there. That is aids. He shoots, I believe. And then it just comes to my keeper. Back of my player. And into the goal. And, yeah, FIFA aids right there. But straight from kickoff, I'm like, screw this. I really need to get a goal back. I'm going to try and run it for halfway line. I never even try and run it for halfway line. And we score a goal running from the halfway line. I mean, can we call that a skill goal? couple of skill moves in there, I don't, I don't really know, but like, it didn't really help much because we did actually lose the game 1-0 anyway in the end, 1-0, sorry 2-1 in the end, but we did score a fantastic goal with El, with El Shahari there from kickoff, which I'm, I'm quite proud of, you know, every time I normally try and run it, I get tackled or I mess up or some, something like that, so very happy with that goal, but not happy with the result, 2-1, I think I felt like I could have got something out of that game, it's just really bad defending on my part, that um, you know, should have um should have stopped him from scoring basically but yeah so it is division six we're in um so we've it's out of three games we've won one we've drawn one we've lost one what do you know and um yeah so mm, i think we could have won beat that greenwood guy just really poor defending 19 points for the title in this division um i can't actually quite see because my webcam's in the way the championship is six thousand promotion is four thousand eight hundred okay well i expect to win get promoted if not the title but this is what i want to speak to you This is what I want to speak to you guys about. Sorry about the cut there. Um, um, because 
you know, Fever's been out quite a while. Um, I haven't really been doing it much for Road to Glory on this account because I kind of wanted this to be as like my sort of YouTube account, if you know what I mean, separate from uh, my actual account that I use, like for fun and obviously, uh, like if you like with friends and things like that. So, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to swap over to that account to record on, um, for the Road to Glory. So the next one will sort of be like a fast forward in the future thing, if you like. Because I played obviously so many matches on that man account because that's what I play on it for fun. I've done the foot weekend a few times, a couple of times on there. Um, so the first video you will see uh, on that account, and I knew it would take over Road to Glory because I've been on it a lot more because I play it for fun. Obviously, so in my free time, I just like still play it. So I record when I actually play it for free time. So there'll be loads more videos of this to come out. <laughs> um, will be uh, the foot weekend rewards because I've just completed it. Um, as I'm doing this, I literally completed it today because it is the Sunday. Um, I won't say what I got. Um, I will say I'm a little bit disappointed. I think I could have definitely uh, got at least one higher, maybe two higher than I did. Um, but yeah, so there'll be some do the rewards for that in the first video, and uh, I'll show you my teams that I've got. And um, yeah, basically, I put up playing the matches in that though. Just play, my, show you my teams, and um, maybe a bit of my records, things like that. Um, yeah, so yeah, that's basically what I'm going for. Hopefully, um, you don't mind that, guys. Just let me know if you, if you think that's a good idea or not, because I am a lot in the future. I've got a lot better players and things like that, so it might be a bit more exciting for you guys than uh, waiting ages for this, because obviously, yeah, I only play this, what, maybe this, on this account, maybe two, twice a week or something like that, and the other one I play, I don't know, maybe five or six times a week. So, yeah, um, it's just got so much better. But I'm going to stop blabbering on. Let me know if you... If you like that idea or not, um, but that's what's going to be the next World of Glory video after that. The Foot Weekend Rewards on the other account, which is going to take over the World of Glory series. So, yeah. Um, basically, just thanks so much for watching. If you want to see that and um, any all the other videos on the account, then please hit the subscribe button to uh, not miss out. And obviously, if you want to see more of me. So, thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time.